What's up guys, it's Tenno here and today I'm gonna show you how to play Graves Jungle, so let's go with this. I'm playing against Warwick, we want to start with E first and let's get to his skill explanation. So on passive, Graves shotgun has some unique properties. Graves must reload when he runs out of ammo, so he has two aura attack stacks and after that he has to reload. Reload speed is faster as you level up and as you get some attack speed items. Then he deals more damage to enemies while being closer to them, same with structures. So for example when taking objectives you want to stay as close as you can to deal more damage. Also bullets cannot pass through units, meaning that if between you and your enemy are minions for example, you need to get rid of them or pass through or else you won't deal damage to your enemy. As for your E, this is a dash in direction basic attacking lower the cooldown of E by half second and you want to E right after your aura attack. Also when taking caps you want to time your basic attack. So in the moment of the camp aura attacking you you want to knock him back. As for the Q it deals damage at the start and after 2 seconds or 0.2 seconds after if it collided with terrain. So usually when possible we just want to queue like this to just trigger it faster as you can see. I have advantage against Warwick Illy so it's fine, okay never mind. Nundra can follow up so it's fine. Oh, and at this point... Yeah, I knew that I can go aggressive. So, Oro, E, and that's it. And Q. It's the most important mechanic, to be honest. So, as for your W... W is a slow by 50% for half second, also dealing some magic damage. And your enemy is not able to see anything while being affected by W. So if he steps on W or if you just cast that on him. So you see, that way you can clear easily. So camp tried to auto attack me and I just deny that and that way clear is really good in terms of sustain. It's my dot. You want to max Q first and as grace you should be mainly farming. But, especially if you have red buff, you can apply some pressure on lanes to burn flash or get a kill. So now I try on mid. It's good if your laners have CC because you have damage, so with the right stun you can just... I actually tried to wait for his flash so then I can Q. That's probably... He would flash my Q anyway. So let's try getting this almost gold. I'm standing as close as I can to just do more damage. So it's 31 and now 46 as you can see. Alright, some gold advantage already, nice. And you just want to farm farm. His late game is amazing, you can carry games. So Grace is a nice champion overall to one trick. Casting W on Raptors is the best because this camp is annoying. Thinking Timo, I think he knows, yeah. He has no, he has no flash. No 
So the best stat on Graves is attack speed and AD, so I just go for my red smite now. Red smite, some CDR, boots, red trinket, and let's go farming. Plus Graves you don't need to do crazy stuff, just have to farm and later we will carry. So to save some time I'm just heading in the direction of the camp by just killing the camp. And now his ultimate, it deals damage when it collides with an enemy and then the damage passes through, just the second damage is not as great as the first one. It knocks you back so it can work as an escape. If you are standing, let me show you. do this so it knocks you back if you just stand like this and out you can get to the other side also you can just dash come to jungle a bit no jungler is able to keep up with your CS Ah, trinket here. Though, if Syndra manages to almost, but even if I didn't get a kill, it's enough just to give Syndra some advantage. I just want to push that. I don't think that Warwick is able to kill me now. So let's push a bit. I have flash in case. It's a bit greedy from me, but he is half HP. Keep in mind about Red Smite. You will have to back so I just do blue buff and maybe invade his jungle. I can also help Timo. Uh, it's not yet. Not there. Bot lane is losing heart. And after jungler item you want to build Storm Razor and usually then it gets really smoother in terms of gameplay. You want to max E second. And as for your E, Grace grains true grid for 4 seconds. True grid grants armor stacking up to 8 times. So if you dash toward an enemy champion again 2 stacks. And as you rank up this ability, the armor bonus is better. So that makes Graves really tanky. That will help me especially against Fat AD Khan.
now we need to react to that. Race has nice wave gear, so we'll probably be able to save that. Okay, so hold. I flashed cause Victor. Oh, fight Kate. Okay, I have to get items. So this and Storm Razor. Only because bot lane is so fat, I probably won't get another Drake. At least it's Ocean. Gonna try on Garen. Want an assist. I need as close as I can, and the damage is isn't bad. Two hundred. Let's try rift. Caitlyn is there, but I think that she will go full farm. Alright, so got a nice shutdown on Kate. I'm just back because I have faster recall. So Storm Razor. Actually this. And I can afford Tabi, no not yet. Now the clear is really fast.
Mm. And that's it. I just heal on red, also I have to play Rift soon. Probably on board. Is heading there. I won't risk them. Another ocean. I'm going from this side is not twice. Another Q, not there. I have out soon. Not necessary though. Try to save my ally. In that case, I'm just gonna... Yeah, I had to ult to just avoid some damage from Garen. Sometimes you can do it like this. Add some more farming. I'm really scaling well into late game, so I think that we'll win this. Even if they get third ocean. It won't make a difference. Are we going for the fight? Hopefully not, cause we cannot. Unless they make a good engage. I'm not gonna face check. Hmm. They overextended. I just park now. I go bot now, they will follow and kill me. So just this. That'd be clever. It's okay. As long as they are not focusing me because I position well, it is fine. What are you playing at? And I can just wave you. I just wait for my team. Red is up soon. Lucky. Easy partner. I'm 
Nalu fight. For a moment I thought it could be Penta. But yeah. Not this time. Come on Timo. Actually, I just basic attack right. So let's say it's fine. can take this or not. The important thing is not to overstay. Easy partner. Sindra can follow up. If she can she missed. I just slow him a bit. Mm, that's too much. Inferno is gone. vision for that. I'm not going for Inferno cause Katie is there, they can kill me and then they will do Baron, not worth it. One mistake and it's over. Nah, just let them. Doesn't mean that we we'll lose just because of this. Ah, almost. But at least I stopped Baron, right? We just need to group as five. We are stronger as five. Victor is behind compared to Sintra.
Ed Vine is that guy? I'm just trying to damage whenever I can. That's protect. Somehow they died low. <laughs> so that's it. It's Baron. Hmm. Hi. Now we just want to push first. Okay, now we can take the trick. Let's counter jungle a bit. Okay, so this and let's go bot. I'll go through it. They engage too much on ground, and I can destroy them. See, guys, this is the power of Grace late game. Me that. Oh yeah! Remember to stay as close as you can for more damage. And that's it guys, hope that you learned something out of the race. Leave a like, subscribe and see you next time!